But there are going to be people that figure out how, figure out ways to have the conversation. Cool. But in my mind, G, it's not even remotely close. If we're talking about the the the, the top, mm-hmm. it's to, it, it's it's just when you think about precision coming through, performing all the shit. It's just Dot just comes and does what he does. So, what the fuck are we talking about? All right, cool. Let's it's say attempting different. Messing with different styles, challenges, putting people on different spaces, different voice actors, oh, like right, what are you, all right, bro. personalities. What come do you want? What do you want? What we what are we talking about? So so okay, but let's let's say let's say we have a a, a coastal bias. Mm-hmm. Is anything is anything remotely as disgusting as New York and how they're revealing <laughs> themselves and their bias? God, I'm I am officially done with New York, <laughs> like done. Is it crazy that they just adopted Drake? Have him, have him. <laughs> like, because you know, you know, you know. The, if if anything can like Drake, Drake, Drake is unstoppable, right? If any, if anything can stop Drake, it's New York adopting him. <laughs> <laughs> Think of, no, seriously. That's, it, that's the kryptonite. <laughs> it, New York is 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 because they do it to themselves. I didn't. I, I always felt that way. But again, I'm not from there. I don't know nothing. I don't have. It's just speculation. But it always felt that way. And it. And it. When I realized it, so why? Why the fuck was Andre 3000 so pressed at that Source Awards? Mm. The South got something to say. The, the New York niggas was up there booing Outkast. Mm-hmm. Okay, strike one. Then there's other shit that's gonna happen in history. But I'm just I'm just using these for 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 checkpoints. They boo outcast. All right, cool. Strike one. Now, uh, Van Lathan posts the the reasonable doubt versus four hundred degrees thing. It's like one out one album is better than the other. Nigga, I y'all know how I feel about Hove. There's no de- there's I love Hove, but there's no debating which one of those records had more impact in real time. Mm-hmm. It's not even fucking close. But let New Yorkers tell it. Nobody, wasn't nobody checking for 400 degrees. No, nigga, y'all weren't. Mm-hmm. The rest of the world, though, knew what time it was. Dude, All right, so cool. what, six million, five million on that one? Strike two. <laughs> <laughs> then, the 50 and Ja Rule thing happens. Mm. Ja Rule's one of the biggest artists in the world, nigga. Number one after number one after number one after number one. And then the cool nigga come and tell y'all... This ain't cool no more. While doing the nigga style. And y'all and New Yorkers let that shit rock, bro. Hey, I remember being a kid going, that's kind of weird, but all right. Cause clap back was hard to me. <laughs> but I'm <laughs> but I get it, because the 50 wave was just so big. I I fully get it. Fast forward to the verses. Do you know that these these fucks were be you know how we pick be, you we usually pick before the verses mm-hmm. they are what running around picking Joe I'm definitely talking about you and Ice and y'all dumbasses them niggas pick Fat Joe to beat Ja Rule in a verses twenty songs lean back Lex lean back remix Lex <laughs> how many, and, how many lean back you gonna put in is there <laughs> any world where you pick Fat Joe over Ja Rule no. Like, and every, everybody was blowing me up because I've been saying it for however the fuck long on the show. Y'all got jaw fucked up, but okay. None, none, nonetheless, the verses happens and everybody's oh man, we we sorry. Y'all didn't know that the one of the one of the one of the niggas who it's, it's only been a few niggas who, who have come through and have done what Ja Rule did, and y'all y'all had the nerve to undermine him. He's the original Drake. Yeah, supposedly number one songs don't play well in the verses from Versus Aficionados. <laughs> number number <laughs> ones don't play. What are you talking? I'm I'm so done. That with goalpost these, get booed for every single. I'm individual. so done with these experts, G. The experts and their and their biases. It it just it reveals it reveals itself. And and New York and New York goes. Well, we don't understand. Why the industry is doing everything and stuff? Because y'all don't have y'all don't y'all literally are just wave riders. Whatever the wave is, New York just come hop on it. What's that? What out outside of we? They've been riding that. Oh, we we where it started at, nigga. I don't even know that to necessarily be true. <laughs> y'all started hip hop. 
It was niggas on the West Coast doing doing techno and ele- and drum and bass shit for 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 a long time. That don't get credit for that shit. So I, I I'm not rolling. This is crazy to say. <laughs> this is absolutely crazy no, to say. No, I mean, no. I'm I'm fed the fuck up, bro. I'm hey, so fed up. Run that shit. I'm so <laughs> fed up. Run that shit. I'm. How 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 is nobody else upset at these niggas just running around creating these bunk ass narratives? Tell you the truth, New York just be talking to themselves. Just be bro. saying anything. <laughs> they they be talking to themselves. They just happen to occupy so much space over in that area over there. Like they just be talking to themselves. You know, it, it is what it is. It is that they, they you know, it, it's just about not being in the conversation anymore, and that's that's a tough pill to swallow. Hmm. Like, who do you have right now? Yes, the South is, the South has they they birth artists like no other. Like that shit is just a natural fucking. Uh, who was that though? Just talking about that. Um, uh, birth from bro, that, the white dude with the curly hair that went on the um, on the shop. Did you oh, watch the last episode of the shop? The um. No, no, I haven't seen it. Not Russ. Russ was on there, would he? Mm-mm. No, I forgot his name, but it's like he he makes like the he makes kind of like trap music a little bit, a little bit. Not Jack Harlow. That one, yeah. yeah. So Jack Harlow was on there. He was just talking about like him uh, migrating over to the South, like mm. to, to when he started like working on the sound a little bit more. Um, and he was he was a writer or whatever, so like he would be like these introspective raps and stuff like that. Mm. But going in the south, and it was like, no, none of the motherfuckers use a pen or a pad or anything. It's all just punching in. Yeah. So like everybody just having like just just doing their natural thought. Like this is like the this is how the wave is over there. Like right. they're just constantly you know picking up on whatever it is that you can have in that moment. Whatever you feel in that moment is the is the sound over there, right. and that's what's being birthed. Nonstop, right? So, like, that's you know, that's, I'm pretty sure that's 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 just a tough pill to swallow. I think it is for like the for New York to realize that. Yes, our sound could have birthed everything. Supposedly, I don't know. I, I don't know the origin story. My bad. I'm not, I'm not a music, but it's branched out, and now in the current popular area that we're in what moves units and what has like the most artists come into the fray it has to do with a, a specific sound that is southern or has a little bit more melodic feel to it mm. and that's something that y'all niggas can't, can't wrap your brains around as being melodic whatsoever but you know yes they can Ja Rule was doing it and then they killed him for it and then let Fifty come do it too. I know, but that's they, the that's the part that is weird. They can't go back and do it though. DJ Premier isn't from New York, by the way. I just want to like <laughs> this is what we do. <laughs> it's it's I'm oh I'm fed up, bro. I'm I'm this it's making me upset. Marty, you just came in. Oh yeah. DJ Premier. Yeah, my, bad. my bad. That was good. Yeah, that, that was a that was a specific conversation everybody had. It was my like, bad. nope, I'm I'm dropping this mic right he's now. He's not he's not even from that, but that's the nigga that they go, oh, that's a boom bap sound. That nigga's from the south. So saying like come on, come on, New York. I I got too much family and too many niggas I like really, really fuck with. Where's, that, where's uh, Alchemist from? <laughs> Almost do it. G, stop playing. Because Alchemist is from the West Coast, bro. Stop playing with me. God damn it. So, oh. so you tell me niggas just recruit? Yes. Oh. <laughs> they, just, they, do, they do their they G, do their own draft. Don't, just, do, bro, don't just, do that. Don't do that. Just just not, not today. It. Don't do that. Just keep I, I taking really the hope, draft picks. I was looking for something to throw just now. <laughs> <laughs> so you tell me they're just hoarding draft picks. So just take, her, take, take whoever they want. Man, listen. I'm... If okay. you spent a few days out here, bro, nigga, if you made a soul with a nigga that was about here, bro, okay. you in New York. If you was born out there and then moved when you were two, nah, nah, he's from New York. That's his birthplace. Nah, if you just popped up over there, bro. I, if, if you spent a few days out here, and you, birth, you, you made a mixtape over nigga, here? Nigga, Hove got the nerve to say birthplace of Michael Jordan. Fam, stop. <laughs> stop. You don't, get to, you don't get to do that. You don't. Who else show up? Who else show up? Um... <laughs> 